Hello there, I'm your host Dan Rojas and I have a big 65 inch Fresnel lens. I'm gonna see if I can melt a hole through a saw blade. This is very thick steel and it's designed for high temperature so we're gonna see what happens. It's not at the optimal focus yet. Here we go. The front part's bubbling. Ah, we went through. Went completely through a saw blade with a large Fresnel lens. Keep in mind, steel dissipates heat. So to do that, it requires an enormous amount of heat. So this is a little metal can lid. This is a lot thinner, um, so this, will, this should go really fast. A lot of people have done videos melting through something like this. This should be very easy to do. So I'm zoomed in on it and I'm gonna go focus the Fresnel lens on the target. complete obliteration. <laughs> this is a blade from a carpet knife. That was easy. That was all with the power of the sun. You wanna make sure that you store your Fresnel lens in the shade, cover it. I cover this every day. I have a cover for it. They're right there. They go on top of it and it's mounted to it. So if it blows over, it can't come off. You don't want these doing their own thing when you're not around because you can see just different areas here. That's, this is what happens when it's off axis. It can actually, it, it's not as fast, but it will devastate anything. This was uh, one that I did earlier. I'm gonna redo this video. We melted a rock and made this beautiful black glassy material. I'm your host, Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos. This was an old bad saw blade, so 
wasn't a brand new one. 